Good morning, Panthers. Today is Monday, March 1st, 2021. Please join me for a few moments of morning prayer and reflection. Let's begin with our mission statement. St. Anthony de Padua Catholic School develops lifelong learners who live their faith through stewardship and are committed to Catholic virtues and academic excellence. This week, we will hear parables about something that is lost. Jesus uses images that those listening to him would understand. A shepherd with his sheep, a woman with a coin, and a man who lost a son. In each of these parables, Jesus is responding to the Pharisees who dislike that Jesus was preaching to sinners. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Tax collectors and sinners were coming near to listen to Jesus, and the Pharisees and the scribes were grumbling and saying, this fellow welcomes sinners and eats with them. So Jesus told them this parable. Which one of you, having a hundred sheep and losing one of them, does not leave the 99 in the wilderness and go after the one that is lost until he finds it? When he has found it, he lays it on his shoulders and rejoices. And when he comes home, he calls together his friends and neighbors saying to them, rejoice with me for I have found my sheep that was lost. Just so I tell you, there will be more joy in heaven over one sinner who repents than over 99 righteous person, persons who need no repentance. The gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Think about this silently in your heart. Why would the heavens rejoice when one person comes back to God? Loving God, we are sometimes lost like a sheep. Help us find our way back to you where we trust in your welcoming arms. We ask this through our good shepherd. Amen. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Please join me in reciting the Pledge of Allegiance. Our flag today comes from Kayla in kindergarten. Thank you, Kayla. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Thank you so much. Our virtue of the week this week, and this will be for the entire month. Our virtue this week is sacrifice. Ooh. Sacrifice, yes, sorry. This week is sacrifice, the strength to forgo one's own benefit for the good of others. So the strength to forego one's own benefit for the good of others. So during Lent, we all are working on a Lenten sacrifice, and that's a sacrifice we're making to help better ourselves. But there are other sacrifices you can make. Um, think about some sacrifices you can do at home, maybe extra chores to help your family. And that's a sacrifice, giving up something you want to do in order to help someone else. Last week, I forgot to do the student of virtue, so I'm very sorry, but let's do that right now. This student was nominated for the virtues of charity, service, and altruism. She often puts others ahead of herself. She does acts of charity in her classroom, school, and at home. She often volunteers to do tasks such as running errands within the school building or taking care of the flag flying in front of our school. She brought in many needed items for the St. Vincent de Paul food drive. She helps out at home with caring for her younger brother and elderly grandfather. Thank you so much to Isabella Catanzarite, our student of virtue. If you haven't, um, well, you wouldn't know. So please come to the office after announcements, Isabella. We have a little something for you. All right. I believe that's all the announcements that we have for today. Panthers, it's going to be a great week. We're starting a new month, a new week. So I um, hope everybody has an open heart and is ready to do their best, both on treating one another well and on your schoolwork. Let's sign off with our St. Anthony Faith Pledge. We, the students and faculty of St. Anthony de Padua Catholic School, vow to be Christ-like for the world. May our eyes see Christ in one another. May our mouths speak words of love and kindness. May our ears listen for ways to serve. May our hands reach out to help. 
May our feet walk closely with Jesus so we may live in his light. Jesus, light for our world, shine in us and through us. Have a great day, Panthers, and St. Anthony de Padua. Pray for us.